Hello viewers. Hello. Welcome to the channel. We're about to do an experiment on removing rust. We've got some uh, old railway spikes. We uh, think we can regenerate some old history. So we're gonna get some plain white vinegar. Just brought down at the local store. Very cheap for two liters. We're gonna use a empty ice cream container. You could use any kind of container. Yep, which spike have you got? So we'll put yours there. There we go. And put them in there. Make sure they're in there. And then we're going to pour the vinegar in. Uh, Go for it. How are we so put, stand back, viewers? guys, just in case this splashes everywhere. I so still just have enough. no idea what viewers mean. There we go. Poured it so it just covers the spikes. Looks like we're going to use about all the two litres. There we go. About one and a half litres. Our spikes are submerged. So we'll come back in 24 hours and see how they gone. have gone. And we'll take some photos along the way so you can see if anything's happening. All right, thanks. Here we are, the first few minutes of the spikes being submerged in white vinegar. We'll keep you posted on how they go. So we've got one, two, three. These things have been out in the air, rusting for years, decades even. So we will watch if this actually works. I'm skeptical, but let's wait and see. You've got nothing to lose. Okay, bye. We are 24 hours after putting our vinegar into our railway spikes. They don't look much different. There's a few rusty flakes sitting at the bottom of the thing, if you check out the picture beforehand. We're only gonna take one spike out today and give it a bit of a scrub off to see if it actually works. It's fine. It's Nate's. I think we've uh, just yeah, made pickle spikes more than uh, actually clean uh, railway spike. It's very stinky too, by the way. There we go, yeah, let's let that drip. It. Give it a quick wipe. We'll try the side. I know I'm going to wash it with this. It definitely takes the rust off, but it doesn't really make it not brown. So, no, I don't know if it works. Maybe, Maybe they were. I don't think it's... Uh, I think they were built shiny not, and clean. They probably were shiny at some stage. Uh, I don't think this is going to bring it back. So, All right, Nady, give it a bit of a scrub with the uh, toothbrush. Go. That's Toothy. We might come back in another 24 hours Are and you see. Are kidding me? Why? And see Why if they come off a little bit better. I don't think they're going to get shiny like we were hoping. Um, okay. Yeah, look, I'll take a photo so you can see the difference. Is this gonna... And to um, the other ones. Yeah. That one's still hoping. Kind of disappointing. We really do have pickled spikes. So we're going to take a photo of that. And see how we go from you there. might find more it than, smells uh, like fish and chips too. No, that smells like <laughs> just vinegar. Okay. Back 48 hours later. 48 hours later. Our pickled spikes pickled. have yeah, gone pickled. fluffy and bubbly yeah, and weird. it's very very strange if you look at the photo yeah. earlier. So we're going to rip out another one. Now it was very messy yesterday. I learned the hard way that it uh, flicks up a lot of orange rust and stuff like that. So we're going to get a scourer which will be deeper of the That's clean. Scour. Yeah, feel this. <laughs> yeah. Nice oh, and solid. The the two plus did a good job but it wasn't great. So the original spike yesterday which was Nate's come up all right that, we did it i'm late maybe the or the uh, thing yeah maybe it was it made another, like that it's gone rusty again from mm -hmm. being in the thing yeah that's weird oh, we get different balls. all right so we'll grab another spike out and see what 48 hours does to the thing out mm, still rusty still rusty just gotta give it so a we'll give it a good scrub and we'll see what happens scrub eh? up, we'll paint scrub paint with the water. toothbrush again see that seemed to work. I think so then we're going to use the fast thing. forward and see what's going on. Fast yeah, forward. we'll do a bit of a time lapse to show you the clean of it. We'll come back and we'll show you the progress. Keep watching.
week later. A week later. Um, and you look in this sloppy brown stew. Oh. How yuck does that look? Did you drink that? No. No, I wouldn't know that. But the amazing thing it. is, we pull our railway spikes out. It's clean. They are rust free. Yeah. Give a bit of a bit of a scrub off. So our pickled spikes have now turned back into beautiful railway spikes. So we will get them dry. But yeah, you can see from the toothbrush, it's not real flash. Um, we'll, dry, we'll give them a dry um, and show you the pictures of before and after. And yes, this does work. Just plain white vinegar. It does. Nine days sitting in vinegar and it just came, it comes off. Yeah, it was nine days in the end. Yeah. They just come off. Um, that is very real nice. So we will have to dry them and keep them dry. Um, but yeah, they've gone back to a silver metallic y. Also, do you thing. like Dad's t shirt? It's cool. It so, says the thanks for watching. And, and if you want to give it, give it your own experiment, um, just plain white vinegar, $2 or whatever it is from the local supermarket for two litres. No and pour it in there and just leave it. And, and remember to like and subscribe to Snivery 2000 and the comments kids. Yeah! Press that button. And I'm Ned Flutter. Delicious! Kid! Delicious! Kid!